Hi, I'm Jessica. And I'm Natasha. We're sisters and the co-founders of Wellbeing Sisters. It may not seem so, but women are dramatically underserved by the health and beauty industry. So many of the beauty and household products on the market contain toxins that mess with our hormone systems and damage our health. Finding safe alternatives isn't easy. In fact, it's a minefield. Wellbeing Sisters are here to help. Most people simply don't realise how chemicals we come into contact with every day can be toxic to our health and how reducing them and changing our diet, nutrition and lifestyle can be absolutely transformative for every stage of a woman's life. I decided to cut toxins when I changed my lifestyle to improve my chances of getting pregnant. I'd been trying for years and several doctors had told me there was nothing more I could do to improve my fertile health. So I started researching, I changed my diet, I took the right supplements and I cut toxins from my life. The difference was incredible. I'm expecting a little girl any minute. Having been involved in Tasha's journey and seen the challenges she faced, I decided it was time to put my experience in structured finance to a more meaningful use. In November 2019, we launched Fertility Box, the UK's first subscription box for women trying to conceive, to rave reviews. Fertility Box made it easy and enjoyable for women to improve their fertile health naturally. With an extremely limited marketing budget, we signed up 100 subscribers in the first two months and worked with 25 brand partners. But we wanted to do more to help women at all stages of womanhood. So we rebranded and Wellbeing Sisters was born. Over the summer of 2020, we launched a number of one-off boxes which quickly sold out. Our shop sales continue to increase and over 40% of our customers come back for more. In early 2021, we're launching our subscription box. It's going to be the world's first health and beauty subscription box tailored towards the different stages of womanhood, including trying to conceive, pregnancy, early motherhood, midlife and the menopause, and a universal box for every woman who just wants to be healthier. In each box, there'll be top quality supplements and nutritional products, clean beauty, skincare and lifestyle products, plus tailored health and wellbeing advice. Research shows that a tailored experience is key to a successful subscription box. At Wellbeing Sisters, women will be able to update their profiles to keep the advice and products they receive completely tailored to their stage of womanhood, increasing enjoyment and ensuring customer longevity. The UK subscription box market is forecast to be worth £1 billion by 2022, up 72% in four years, and growth of over 200% is expected in spending on health and beauty subscriptions in the same period. When the girls first approached me, I was absolutely blown away by their ideas and enthusiasm to improve women's health and well-being. And as a woman who's pretty much been through most stages of womanhood, I really wanted to be part of this. I came across the Wellbeing Sisters website and started using their products and their supplements and then I got loads of advice from themselves and Dr Larissa Corder. I know that I can pick up one of their products whilst trying to conceive and whilst pregnant and know that it's completely and utterly safe without even having to look at the ingredients. There's just so much conflicting information out there about what is and isn't safe to use on a daily basis, whether it's your cosmetics, tea candles, even your toothpaste and hand sanitizer. That's why I was so excited to help the Wellbeing Sisters put together their list of toxins to avoid. We need your help for the next stage of the Wellbeing Sisters journey to launch and market our subscription box. For us, it's not enough to have all of our products and information in one place online. We want to bring this directly to the doors of millions of women in a bespoke subscription box service. Join us on our mission to improve the health and well-being of every woman.